having a mural like this, it adds so much to just the tone of our building and just, it just makes the building feel more at home. And we have Hickman such a diverse campus. We got kids from all over the world here. And just having, doing celebrations such as Hispanic Heritage Month and being able to honor at least some of our cultures with that, that are represented with a mural like this, it brings me a lot of pride because I know that our kids put a lot of work into it, Ms. Ballas put a lot of work into it, and it just does so much as far as just the overall decor of the building and making it feel like home. Initially, our plan was to create a festive mural for Cinco de Mayo, but since we didn't finish it, we thought it would be good to honor Hispanic Heritage Month. We started last school year after spring break, and we were trying to finish it for Cinco de Mayo, but we didn't finish. We decided to finish it for Hispanic Heritage Month. We have been working on it on and off since we came back to school. It was like a class project. Like, everyone were working, was working on the flowers, and we all worked hard on it. We were mixing paints, um, cleaning the brushes and everything like that. And we were also tracing it around. At Hickman, we have a diverse student and teacher population. It's important to celebrate all of the cultures we have represented at our school. It's important to our school and honor someone else's heritage. My teacher, Miss Ballas, she gave us four big flowers, but they were like folded and she told us to make them at home and bring it back to school so we can decorate the outline of the mural. It just brings us a lot of pride just to be able to celebrate students from across Latin America. Being able to know that we're including all students in that group and being a part of this, it brings me a lot of pride that we're creating such an inclusive environment.